In this video, we'll be reviewing the Conversations section of your menu. Click into Conversations and the first column you'll see here on the left shows you a list of your messages. You can navigate between unread, recents, and all. Unread messages are messages that have not yet been read. Recents will show messages received within the last several days. And all will of course be all of your messages. You can search here in this box for a specific message. When you click into an unread message, you'll see the conversation history here in the center. In order to make the conversation no longer appear as unread, you can do one of a few things. You can respond using an SMS or email down here in the bottom left, or in the top right, you can mark the conversation as read. This center portion here will show you your conversation history. You can scroll up and even fetch older messages depending on the length of history of conversations you've had with the particular contact. The third panel on the right hand side will show you a snippet of the contact information for the user that you are interacting with. You can actually click the phone button to call the phone number. You can view their email address here. You can add tags. You can toggle on or off the DND to either allow someone to receive marketing campaigns or not, and you can also add them to a campaign by clicking the Add button under Active Campaigns. There are two buttons on the bottom right you can use as well. You can click Create Opportunity to create an opportunity for someone. You'll go ahead and fill out this information, click Add, and the opportunity will be added. You can click Schedule and here you can book an appointment for the user. Don't forget to click save in order to confirm the appointment. In the top right, where you're able to mark conversations as read, you can also delete a conversation if you want to completely eliminate it from your system, or you can archive a conversation as well. So this has been an overview of everything you can do in the conversation section. Mostly it will be used for responding to customers where automation might not cut it.